Hey guys, so today I'm doing something really cool. This is Nepenthes glandulifera. Um, so tropical pitcher plants are male and female on different plants, just like people. Lots of plants have male and female parts on the same flower, but these guys actually have a sex, just like people do. Um, so this is a male, and it's making pollen right now. And what we're about to do that's really cool is we're gonna make pure seeds, or seeds of the pure species Nepenthes glandulifera. And because they're male and female, we need two blooming at the same time, which doesn't happen very often. It can take 10, 20 years to bloom a Nepenthes, depending on the species. Some of them are a little faster, but they can take a while. So on this plant, there are some yellow anthers. There's actually not a lot today, but there's one that's good. I'm just gonna take that one off of there, like that. And then we're gonna go over here to the jungle. Not that far though. And over here I have a female flower of the Pinthes uh, glandulifera. And they're just starting to open and they have a little platform right there for the pollen to go onto. And I'm just gonna take that anther and touch it there, put a little yellow pollen on each of these. And because each of these are um, individual flowers, every single one can make a different cross technically. So I've divided the flower and um, above I'm doing pure glandulifera and then I actually crossed these first few flowers by Edwardsiana, so that should be really, really cool. Not a lot of those crosses around. But anyway, right, so like in a few years, when we have Nepenthes glandulifera seed grunts for sale, this is how we did that. <laughs> 